What up, peeps? It's your boy, The Penguin, and I'm telling you that we have brand new logos and new merch in the Wicked Turtle store. Some of the new merch is a fanny packs. We do have masks because we are in a pandemic. Some of the new logos that I'll tell you right now are, are you turtly enough for the Turtle Club? Hey, man, are you a wingman? Listen, we also have a Little Penguin shirts. Remember, all proceeds from the Little Penguin merch goes to the Little Penguins College Fund. And hey, listen, are you guys always trying to figure out what is the answer to the question of what up, peeps? Well, now you can wear that merch. Check it out at teespring.com backslash stores backslash Wicked Turtle and join the club today. peeps it's your boy the penguin and welcome back to another sandwich edition of penguin eats today on penguin eats i decided to go to biagio's here in lebanon pennsylvania to get a Sandwich and when I walked in I only wanted to get like um, they had their meat lovers Italian hoagie. I just wanted to get that But instead They said we have Cubanos and I'm like ooh, 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 Cuban sandwich love those things and they had pulled pork today because it's Friday and Friday's Cubanos and pulled pork uh, So uh, let's get into it right now That's the meat lovers Italian. And then here's their Cubano. All right, so let's get down to it. I'm gonna eat this right now. It's really fresh. I'm loving those toppings. The bun, they use a Luciano bakery bun, which is in Philly. So good. Some of the best sandwiches in Philly come from this bread. So, oh man, taste the cheese, the oil. I, I, I got mine with everything. So it has onions, tomatoes, uh, lettuce. Uh, there's a whole bunch of meats on there. Uh, some spicy meats, some capicola, some hard salami. Uh, they have a, 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 a provolone cheese. Th this is a mild provolone. They have a sharp one, which is probably my favorite um, when it comes to these. Pr and these are premium Italian uh, uh, hoagies. They're not like um, like you would get like Mariana's or like you would get like from like a grocery store or something. This is premium ingredients, premium meats, premium cheeses, lettuce, tomatoes, uh, mayonnaise. Like this... It's, it's basically high quality Italian sandwich. Um, but no, this is fantastic after doing my one bite. Let me, uh, let me stuff this, these ingredients back in here and take a second bite. Maybe I can get a bigger bite. Mmm. Mmm. That provolone comes out so well in this. The meat is fantastic. Mmm. So good. This is literally five minutes down the road from my house so mmm so good guys let's try the Cubano never had a Cubano sandwich or Cuban sandwich it's let's tear it apart here so we can show it to you so there you go oh yeah see that let's see let's hope I can not make a mess there you go guys look at all that look at all that meat and if you can see in the back there, there's probably some pickles it's uh, a typical cu Cubano is Swiss cheese, pickles, pulled pork, ham. Um, I've seen it done. Yeah, well, pulled pork, ham. Yes, pulled pork, ham, Swiss cheese, <clears throat> mayonnaise, mustard, um, and pickles. And like just smelling this, dude. It smells like it smells like their meat was smoked. Like it has a very smoky smell to it which is awesome i love smoked meats 
let's let's give her a try. Mm. Mm. This is really good. The smoked meats are fabulous. I sort of like the trend with me lately has been smoked meat, like barbecue. First thing it hits, man, and it's really overpowering. Is the and the star of the show is the pulled pork. The pulled pork is the star of this show. And then you get some pickle in there, which helps it. Um, the ham, the ham is good. And the bread, of course, using the same Luciana bread, I think, and, and they smushed it down. They had a panini press right there when they did it. Dude, this is fabulous. These are good sandwiches. Um, if you're ever in Lebanon, Pennsylvania, or if you are from Lebanon, Pennsylvania, I suggest come out to Viaggio's and uh, get one of these subs. Uh, they have limited time that they're open, um, but because most of the times I, I go past there, it's like in the evening and stuff, and they're, they're usually closed. But that's like how it is with these types of places. Sometimes they either have it till they run out of bread. Um, but, yo, this is good. This is really, really good. Now, they, they, do do, they do do DoorDash here in Lebanon. So if you want to DoorDash some, uh, some of the, these delicious hoagies to you, I suggest that you do, or just go stop in. There was a, there were very nice people that greeted me at the door. They do have a small eat-in area. Of course, you got to wear your protective coverings and stuff when you go in and stuff. But and I'm not saying you have to wear them when you eat, but uh, you have to wear your protection coverings when you're when you're in there. Um, but it's this is this is fabulous. Let's go to a rating now for uh, the hoagie that I got. I'm going 9.5. This was absolutely delicious. I would definitely get this again. Um, it's just there's just so much like the taste as soon as you bite into it the taste the the roll They do have a hard roll now. Let me I, let me uh, interrupt my rating here for a second They do have a hard roll um, that has like sesame seeds on but it's a bit more chewier and man I've, I've got it before man. You will you will dislocate your jaw eating that thing <laughs> It's good though. The bread is fabulous when you get a hard a hard roll it is fabulous, but my personal preference is is I like I like the soft roll because I can actually it's a little, a little bit more palatable for me. As far as the Cubano, really really good on the Cubano. I'm gonna go probably a 9.5 with that too. Again, they only do these on Fridays, which is fabulous. Um, I'm filming this on a Friday, of course. That's why I got, was able to get the Cubano. But uh, they told me next week, next weekend on a Saturday, they will have um, um, chicken outside. They're doing chicken. So uh, you, they'll do, they're doing like uh, chicken barbecue stuff like that. So uh, stop by there next weekend and and pick and see what they have. While you're there, grab a sandwich, take it home. The one thing I can say about these premium hoagies is that is that they last. So you can put, you can wrap it up, put it in the fridge, have it for later or whatever. Um, this is just absolutely fabulous. This is the first time I actually had these guys, and uh, you guys made a customer out of me. Um, Again, they were wonderful people when I walked in. Good customer service. Uh, they were very quick on making their sandwiches. Um, just everything about it was just fantastic. Good customer service, good food, good place. Slap that like button on Facebook and on YouTube. And if you are on YouTube, don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget the bell. Ding, 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 ding. ding. And I'll see you for some more Penguin Eats. Man, I got to get back to this one, man. It's phenomenal. For more information on Biagios, please head on over to Facebook and give them a like at facebook.com slash Biagios Hoagies.